Now, this is a young lady. The, her channel goes by the name of Anime America. And she just found for me a, a, an anime, which is basically hashtag me too. Now, let's see what she has to say. Whoa. Okay. A little later. I feel that the beginning of 2019 felt first few episodes. I felt that this was going to be a good enough show with its premise and interesting characters. So I felt safe when placing Shield Hero at the A rank of the Isekai anime tier list. But then something happened to me when I got past episode four. I wanted to immediately move that rank from A rank to S rank wanted to come up with poster designs because I just wanted to, started ranting about each episode on Twitter, and even bought the Shield Hero t-shirt at Supernova from the Crunchyroll booth. This is oh my god. I don't know what your name is, young lady, but that expression. All right, you've got me scared. <laughs> anyway, let's, let's see what she has to, to say about it. Oh, where are we here? Right about, yeah, here, let's try this. I have to find monsters to level up. As if only being allowed to operate a shield wasn't bad enough, now Mi's luck really takes a turn for the worse when his only teammate suddenly, and I mean suddenly, turns around and accuses Naomi of a crime that he did not commit. And this is the nicest way of putting it because I know Miss YouTube is watching. Okay, let me just get my magnifying glass out here, and there you are. I see you down there, you yellow badge of demonetization, you. But case in point, everyone hates now for me. The other heroes think he's a low-life scum, the entire kingdom is told that he's guilty, and has every advantage taken away from him. No companions, no revenue, and no assistance. He's trapped in a world surrounded by people who are disgusted by the sight of him, and all because of one woman. Wow, this is like real life. You just take it, take away all the fantasy elements, I guess, and this would be happening. This has happened. Can I ask you something, Anime America? Uh, when Bill Cosby was getting hammered by hashtag Me Too. Did you feel as, you know, enraged as you do here? I don't know. You'd have to tell me, but I'm going to guess you probably weren't. You were probably saying, well, look, all these girls came out of the woodwork. They, they can't all be wrong. He must be guilty. Because that was the standard for him. I mean, this particular anime, I mean, it's happening to the main character. So anyone who watches it, of course we feel for him. It would be like so happening, you know, someone in your family getting hashtagged. But I mean, in real life, men do not have that option. You know, a complete stranger is nobody to you. And people can't wait to throw ordinary guys under the bus. I mean, look at Bill Cosby was famous. What's going to happen to some nobody? <laughs> Let's see if you have anything else important to say. Let's try about here then. People ruining his life are taunting him, and they are forcing Raftalia and Naofumi out of their contract. Naofumi's head is full of such hatred and rage. His mind is swirling and aching in pain and devastation. No matter how hard he tries, these disgusting people will shoot him back down and all because they hate him. And that feeling of hatred they have is clearly unjustified. It well, you know <laughs> how we would handle uh, this guy, Shield Hero, in real life? We'd expect him to suck it up. I mean, he would, in his condition, he'd probably be the next school shooter, right? And you know what happens to school shooters? People do not, society does not turn around Anime America and say, hmm, maybe we should, really should not abuse men, you know, not, not falsely accuse them and ostracize them. What society does is say, you know what, we should jail them or hopefully the police will shoot them dead. <laughs> That's how it uh, happens in real life. And every person who watches this anime and gets outraged, really, you should be ashamed of yourselves. Why are you getting outraged? 
I mean, this is just, this is real life. <laughs> it's just happening now as we speak. And <laughs> you call one of these guys a fuck boy. I mean, the typical person is a fuck boy when it comes to that. They, they turn on the average guy. Hell, they, like I said, they, they turn on the celebs. So, I mean, if you look at yourself and most people, you are not one of these heroes. You are one of the scumbags that shoot him down and do this to him. So, <laughs> I think that's all I need to say about this.